Hi, this is Trisha from Lemon Paper Lab. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a polka dot pattern using one of Photoshop's newest features, Pattern Preview. This feature came out with Photoshop 2021. So if you are using an older version of Photoshop, I'll leave a link to my other tutorial on how to create a polka dot pattern using the offset feature um, in a Photoshop. First off, we are going to uh, create our pattern document. So go ahead and click on create new. Uh, the dimensions of this, we are going to do uh, 400 pixels by 400 pixels, uh, resolution 300 pixels per inch. Um, set the background contents to transparent and then go ahead and click on create. Zooming in on my canvas here, uh, command plus key. And then at first I'm going to create my circle. So we'll go over to our shapes tool here and then we'll select the ellipse tool. And then I'm just going to click on the document here and then we'll just create a, um, a circle of uh, 200 pixels by 200 pixels. Okay. And then we'll go ahead and center that using the move tool um, V on the keyboard and then we'll just center it uh, to our document here. And then to access the pattern a preview mode, you're going to go to view and then you'll uh, scroll down here to pattern preview and that um, will kind of extend your canvas and then we'll go ahead and zoom out. So we'll go command uh, minus key here to make it smaller here. And then uh, so now we have a simple kind of polka dot pattern, but we're going to add um, a circle here at the edge. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, duplicate this layer. I'm selecting option and then clicking on the circle here. We'll just drag out to create our additional circle here. And then you can just drag it to the corners and then Photoshop will kind of pre-fill this pattern here. That way you can see a, a grander scale of what your pattern will look like. And then when you are ready to uh, create your polka dot pattern, you'll go to edit and then define pattern. And then you can go ahead and give it a name and then just click on OK there. So. To use this pattern preview mode and to define your pattern, you'll do it with this uh, pattern preview mode open. Um, so if you um, if you turn the pattern preview mode off, it will take away uh, those repeating um, parts in the corner there. So to actually create the pattern, you'll want to make sure you go to edit define pattern while the pattern preview mode is already created. So we'll go ahead and uh, delete this layer here and then let's go ahead and make our, our circle just a little bit smaller. That way you get a little bit more uh, space in between the circles. So we'll select that there. We'll go to again to view pattern preview and then I will duplicate this layer. You can also do that from the layers panel, right click and click on duplicate layer, giving it a name if you prefer and then you can drag it out again to the corners here to get your um, repeating pattern. And then we'll go ahead and define that as a pattern, edit, define pattern, uh, give it a name and then click on OK. So we'll go ahead and exit pattern preview mode here and then we'll create a new document so we can see how our pattern looks. So we'll go to um, file new. Uh, this time I'm going to use the dimensions of digital scrapbook paper. We have uh, 3600 pixels by 3600, uh, resolution 300 pixels per inch, um, color mode is RGB color, and then this time we'll just set our background contents to white. Go ahead and click on create here. Uh, the next step is I'm going to add a solid color adjustment layer. We'll go ahead and set that to white, so FFF for hex code here. And then we'll add a pattern layer. And then here is where you can select um, your most recent pattern. So we select that first one there. We had our kind of bigger polka dots. And then we'll go ahead and add one more solid color adjustment layer. And then uh, this time let's give it, let's do like a, a turquoise here. And then I'm going to uh, clip it to our pattern layer using, um, you can go uh, right click to create clipping mask or you can click between the layers uh, selecting option for Mac users and then click and then it will create a clipping mask there. 
So um, this way, when you use these adjustment layers, you can easily uh, change out the colors again um, if you want to make an additional um, design using uh, this pattern here. Uh, let's go ahead and group this layer, um, Command G on the keyboard to create a group. And then we'll just call a uh, large polka dots. And then we'll go ahead and duplicate this group here. Clicking OK there. And then let's uh, select our smaller polka dots. And clicking OK there. And then we'll just rename this small uh, polka dots here. And then you can just see uh, the two uh, different patterns you have created there. And then if you want to actually save this um, as digital scrapbook paper, you'll go to uh, File, Save As. Uh, go ahead and give it a name, uh, select your folder, and then under Format, you're going to change it to JPEG. And then you'll just want to make sure that this embed color profile is still selected, and then you can click Save. And then uh, here under image options, um, typically you want to save a high quality image. Um, so you can just set it to maximum and then select OK. okay. Thank you for watching this video on how to create a polka dot pattern using one of Photoshop's uh, latest features, the uh, pattern preview mode. This is one of my new favorite features in Photoshop and I'm so excited they added it to it in the uh, 2021 version. If you like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment below. In the description below, I will leave a link to my Etsy shop where I sell digital paper packs. Thank you for watching this video. This is Trisha from Lemon Paper Lab. See you next time.